scanning to the cloud and printing from the cloud using Google Drive. Scanning. To scan to a cloud-based application on the screen of the MFP, you will need to choose the application you require and enter your authentication details. Please note, if you're using user authentication, these details will only need to be entered once as a single sign-on will be functioning. If user authentication is not on, the sign-in details must be entered each time for security purposes. Please click on the application to open and enter your username and password for that application, remembering this may be case sensitive. Click Allow to connect to the application. Once you've logged in, you'll be given two options, print a document or scan a document. We will scan a document by placing it into the document feeder and choose scan a document. You can change the file name at the top of the screen and choose where to store your file in the application. You can change the color if you wish to make sure that you scan in black and white, which can reduce file sizes considerably. If there is no color on the pages, the auto setting will change this accordingly. The resolution can be changed again. This will increase and decrease file sizes, but can give better quality. The file format can also be changed to various, including an OCR option, Optical Character Recognition. In the original tab, the original size can be changed if required. This function is mainly used when scanning from the platen glass. The original can be scanned as a single or a double-sided document. Scan exposure can also be changed to lighten or darken the scanned document. Various modes can be adapted according to your originals. Job Build will allow you to scan a large document in stages, building up the scanned document. When the first group of originals have been scanned through the feeder, you can then load the next section for scanning. Blank Page Skip will delete any blank pages in the scanned file. This is useful if you have a mixture of single and double-sided documents and do not wish to see the blank page in your scanned file. The Preview key will allow you to see the scanned documents on the screen prior to sending. You may be able to edit the file at this stage on the screen. Once all settings have been made, simply press the Start key 
and your documents will be scanned into the machine's memory and then sent on to your destination. After processing, the scanned file can be found in the destination folder that you've selected. Printing from a cloud-based application requires you to log into the application as before, but this time choosing print a document from the options. Choose the document or folder the document is in, then choose a file. Multiple files can be selected to print. Click on the Change Settings to print in the right-hand side menu. Now you can choose to print two-sided, N up, and add a staple if you have this function, sort or group. If the document is colour and you wish to print in black and white, then simply tick the BW button. You can select the quantity of prints you want and press Start or Preview. This will pull your file down from the cloud-based application to your printer and print as desired. You can see the job status in the top right-hand corner of the screen and can cancel the prints if needed. You can then return to the file section screen or switch mode which will take you back to the scan or print options and you can also switch accounts.